Yeah, Carrie, Dan, even the officer we spoke with this morning said this was just a very violent crash, leaving absolutely no survivors. It happened around 1 a.m. Took them five hours before it was finally cleared and they could reopen traffic here on I-15. This all taking place, like I said, on I-15 at 2600 South near the Bountiful Woods Cross exit. Police say a person in a pickup truck was heading northbound in this southbound lane on I-15, ultimately colliding with a much smaller car, a Hyundai Elantra. There was a man and woman inside of that car. Unfortunately, all three of those people died. Report uh, that came in that the truck got on at 2600 South uh, within seconds of us receiving that report uh, we had a collision and a report of a collision uh, the actual crash is about 300 yards north of the 2600 south ramp so it's very very close to 2600 south um, not a lot of not a lot of uh, room there to to catch that truck the accident did shut down those southbound lanes for more than five hours while crews cleared debris and performed their investigation. No word yet as to what caused all of this to happen, but they don't believe alcohol was a factor. We should be getting some more information as the day progresses. Live in Woods Cross, L. Thomas, Fox 13 News, Utah.